KP classes dedicated to excellence. Hello everyone, this is Arit Chandar from KP Gate classes and we are starting a 7 day fast track batch which is going to start from 21st of January that is this month and this video is about the details of this particular course. So let me take you through the details what is it we are going to do in this 7 day fast track batch for gate 2024 so at the outset let me tell you this is for those who want to revise the concepts in the last say 15 days 10 days of your examination so this mainly focuses on the revision aspect of whatever you have learned in your uh, past one year or whatever you have learned in the past five years of your bachelor's how to orient that towards your preparation of gate examination within these seven days so mainly focused on revision practicing questions that's what this revision session or the fast track batch is going to be so let me take you through the details as to what are the resources you will be getting and how we at kp gate classes will help you through these last 10 15 days by taking you through this fast, uh, revision batch or the fast track batch as we call it the seven day batch so uh, firstly at the outset let me tell you i'll talk about the resources too but at the out if i briefly give you an idea this uh, is a course which will go on for seven days uh, classes will be on daily basis and you'll be having around three hours of class every day uh, the uh, focus would be more on the numerical concepts which can be scoring and the, the focus will also be in practicing the past gate questions of at least the recent past gate questions of every subject and also we'll try to cover maximum number of subjects within these seven days of course and also within this course you will have this inclusion you will have the uh, uh, access to two mocks and also two mini mocks as a part of this particular course so let me take you through the details of the lecture plan first so if i talk about the lecture plan we have divided devised it in such a way that you can uh, cover the maximum scoring areas particularly those subjects which are important from exam point of view you all probably are aware it is impractical to expect or to cover 100% of the syllabus within say 7 days if you are at 0 obviously it cannot be something which you can uh, so it's not like gate exam can be learned just in 7 days but what is it we are going to focus on we are going to focus on the revision part we are going to focus on the uh, areas which are scoring we are going to recall the concepts which you have already probably learned in the past so uh, the lecture plan for this 7 day course like I told you the classes will be on 7 day uh, all the 7 days starting from 21st of January that's going to be the first class that is day 1 so you have day 1 till day 7 day wise plan over here day 1 that is on 21st of January we will be revising or we will be going through the concepts of climatology lighting and acoustics uh, which uh, if you know we have divided the class plan devised the class plan in such a way that it covers the common part architecture plan, and planning part all equally important and also obviously uh, all equally uh, covered but then common part because it has a higher weightage we have tried to include as many almost all the topics of common part uh, so climatology lighting and acoustics this uh, part is mainly going to focus on the architecture part that is part v1 majority of it climatology some part of it is in the common part as well then on day two you will be having urban planning and housing which is going to be a part of the common part mainly uh, and also in the planning part you do have urban planning then you have urban design and landscape on day day three on day four you have planning techniques and uh, transportation which is going to be a topic mainly for part b2 that's the planning part other than these, these are mainly going to focus on the common part of your official syllabus. Then day 5, it's going to be project management, estimation and valuation, which is the most important numerical area from the common part point of view. In the common part, if you look into the numerical concepts, project management, estimation, valuation, all the three are common part subjects and it's going to be an important portion from numerical weightage questions point of view. There is no gate paper in the recent past without numerical from project management. So it is very important from numerical part of the common portion that is day 5. Then day 6, we are going to focus on various building services including water supply, plumbing, uh, fire safety etc. All these are going to be again common part subjects. And day 7, our, our focus is going to be on environment, graphics and history of architecture with exception for history. The remaining parts are going to be again common part. History is an architecture subject. That is for B1 with exception for that now obviously history also is not something which we can cover probably in one day completely we if based on the availability of time now this is a tentative schedule based on the availability of time we may add few subjects or remove few subjects probably like history but this is a tentative plan for the seven day batch and if you see it covers close to uh, say around 18 plus subjects or so close to 18 subjects 
um, if you are aware of the KP gate classes module, the plan we follow for the preparation, we have a total of 24 individual subjects we cover, of which so majority of the part will be revised and will be completed, whatever. So if I tell you about the exclusions, if I talk about what is not covered here, so some topics, let's say, let us say like uh, HVAC or elevators, escalators, there are some topics or probably something like building materials. So there are few subjects which were not uh, included because of the availability of time. Uh, so we have made a priority by looking into the recent past pattern and also prioritizing things which can be important, particularly numerical part point of view, because that's where revision becomes even more important. At this point of time, even in your self-study, you cannot sit and learn completely new theoretical concepts, but it is what, uh, what you already know. You need to channelize that. Whatever concepts you have learned, the numerical concepts, you need to revise that. Whatever you probably might have learned in the past, you have to revise that so that's fast track batch the seven day plan in which we are going to orient whatever knowledge you have in a best possible way to maximize the output for gate examination the gate architecture examination that's going to be the class plan uh, so if you see we have uh, given sufficient importance to the common part and also the planning and architecture part so all the portions of the syllabus with their due importance will be considered in the course of this seven day fast track batch for the class plan uh, that's what we have done now talking about the resources or the procedure what exactly can you expect for this seven day batch or what exactly should be the approach for this seven day revision batch of fast track batch so firstly you will be having the live online classes daily you will be having live online classes on daily basis starting from 21st of january so it is 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26 and 27. So you still be will be having 5 to 6 days of uh, time after the completion of the live online classes. You have approximately 5 days of time for your self revision as well. For your self revision after the classes. After the classes you still have 5 days of time. Now, how should you use those five days of time and how we will be helping you by providing resources for that time and talk about that too. So, you'll be having daily online classes and these classes will be uh, up tentatively from 2 to 5 p.m. 2 p.m. to 5 p.m. That's the tentative time. If the time doesn't suit on some of the days for you, if probably you are unable to attend the lecture. You will be having the recorded backup of all these classes. Recorded backup of all the lectures of the revision batch or the fast track batch are available to you till the examination. You can revise the concepts so if you miss out some lecture or want to revise or if you're having a doubt and want to recall in the revision part in the last few days also, you'll be having the access for the recorded backup of all the lectures. And other than that, you will also be having access to mock tests as a part of this course. You will be getting two mocks, two mock tests and also two mini mocks. Mini mocks are smaller versions of the full length mocks which are one hour based tests. Mocks are three hour examinations just like the actual examination. These are the mini mocks. So you'll be having a total of minimum of four tests for your self practice. Uh, and also other than that whatever questions are being discussed in the class that also is something which you have an access to. So that's about the resources which are the most crucial resources in the last 10 days of your preparation and we are going to offer you that as a part of this fast track batch so that's with respect to the class plan and the resources now moving further with respect to the approach what should be your revision approach for the last 10 days now many people have this doubt we are just having few days or couple of say 10 15 days for the examination how should we uh, up what should the approach be in these last few days uh, if you have already completed your self revision you can attend the live classes and during the course of the lecture the most important thing because we are going to focus on those numerical areas the concepts which are important and which will be basically a score based approach you will need to have a complete notes of the preparation whatever concepts are being discussed in the class you'll need to make a handmade notes self notes during the preparation that will be very important for your five day revision after the course also and of this you can also prepare some short notes of some important formulae or some important uh, standards whichever are being discussed in the course of the revision classes you'll need to make a short notes of it as well so that you can revise it two days or one day before the examination also um, so one day or two days before the examination 
if you uh, it is it is uh, impractical to expect that you uh, will not you will uh, you will not even think about the examination that's impractical if you're serious about the examination you're prone to think about the examination the last one day also and at that point of time you will not have time to go through lengthy videos or long lecture notes you should have a handmade short notes with just the important formula just the important standards that's what your revision is going to be on the last few days and uh, you'll need to focus on that in yourself preparation for the last few days and then uh, as i told you you can uh, practice some um, so most of the gate questions some of the recent past we will be practicing those from all the subjects in the sessions itself so you can have a revision on that and as i told you you will be having access to the mock test and you can practice that as well so that's going to be the uh, approach for the revision and that's the about the class plan and the resources we are going to offer as a part of this particular uh, fast track batch for the 7 days so if you are interested you can enroll into this batch and the link for enrolling into the batch is available in the description of this video and we would be glad to help you in your revision for your gate 2024 examination all the best